Steve, thank you very much to everyone that is joining us today. We are going to continue with Hillsborough Community College. And it's Lisa Guadalupe's uh, turn. Hi, Lisa. Are you ready? We are going to... Oh. <laughs> Okay, Hi, hello everyone. I'm gonna just turn off my camera just so it could go a little bit quicker. All right. Hello everyone. Hola, mi nombre es Lisa Guadalupe. Um, muchas personas me preguntan si soy mexicana por mi apellido, pero quisiera decirle que sí porque me encanta la comida mexicana. Eh, pero yo soy nacida aquí en los Estados Unidos y padre y madre dominicano. Um, soy asesora acá. Eh, reclutora de HCC, eh, ubicada en Tampa, Florida, y voy a hacer esta presentación en Spanglish, because my, my Spanish is not very good. <laughs> okay, so HCC fue fundada en 1968, tenemos cinco campus, eh, we are a Hispanic serving institution, so en cada oficina que tú vas, eh, si te sientes más cómoda hablando en español, Um, hay personas que te pueden asistir. En total tenemos eh, 350 estudiantes de F1 de, o, de 80 naciones. Eh, ofrecemos apartamentos de lujo y también Tampa es one of the top 10 safest metro areas in the United States. Why choose community college? Como todos han visto, eh, la matrícula, the lower tuition. Um, nosotros no tenemos requisitos para el SAT. Eh, we have small class sizes, um, capped about 25 to 30 students. We do offer the two plus two program. Y también tenemos el OPT. Aquí está eh, el costo. So, en total, it would be this number um, compared to, um, let's say if you go to UF, um, you would just be doing the first two years at HEC. And then let's say if you want to decide to do UF, you'd be saving a total of $30,000. Um, this price right here is the first year. So you would have to provide this like on your bank statement to say that you, you can come to HCC. So a little bit about our two plus two program. Um, nosotros tenemos un acuerdo con la Universidad de la Florida, las universidades públicas que son 12 como FIU, USF, UF. Um, puedes hacer los primeros dos años en HEC y terminarlo en la universidad. Pero no tanto en, en la Florida. Si quieres transferirse a otra universidad, en otro estado, nosotros tenemos asesor académica que te pueden asistir con ese paso. Um, so no hay, no hay problemas con eso. So nosotros ofrecemos más de 160 programas. Eh, so... Um, Muchos de los estudiantes prefieren hacer el asociado en arte, que sería el transfer para la universidad, como el 2 plus 2, para conseguir su bachelor's degree. También tenemos nuestro asociado en ciencia, que es our, our specialized program, como enfermería, computadora, entrepreneurship, um, opticianary, um, culinary arts, um, Y también tenemos eh, los certificados. So, en vez de tomando dos a cuatro años, um, lo puede conseguir en uno a dos meses, eh, uno a dos semestres, perdón. So, este programa del, de los honores, so HEC Honors Institute, es una buena oportunidad. Eh, nosotros, eh, ellos ofrecen becas para el estudiante. Tienes la oportunidad de tener eh, experimental, experimental learning, 
también en vez de 25 estudiantes tienes la oportunidad de tener solamente 15 estudiantes en una clase. So that'll give you the option of having a little bit more one-on-one -on -one with your professor. And also it just feels kind of like a private institution that you don't have 25 students versus one professor. Um, and then you get to have um, the global scholarship program. So, and then our director of the program, um, if you have a school of interest, they can help you negotiate the scholarships that you might get. And then these are some of the institutions that the students have that were in the honors program have gone to like Boston University, Florida State University, uh, Georgetown University of Florida. And those are our, our former students. <laughs> so what does it take in order to get into our honors program? I can read you the entire list, but the last bullet on the bottom, um, you would just have to have that 3.6 GPA um, or higher after the first semester. So I think this would be a great opportunity and you can apply for scholarships while in the honors program. So OPT, so what is the OPT program? Um, I know a lot of the colleges have been, you know, mentioning what the OPT program is. Um, basically, it's a paid internship that you're permitted to do your F1 student visa, um, but you can do it once you finish your AA program or your AS program. Um, if a student attends a community college first and completes their associate's degree, they can do their uh, year of OPT before transferring. So if you see here, you can do your uh, OPT once you finish your AA and then do the after the bachelor. So that's the advantage of the OPT program. And then if you continue to do your master's program. So aquí tenemos los apartamentos de lujos. Eh, I know that most cities in the United States apartment um, are very expensive. So we do offer student housing. Um, so if you look on here, siempre yo lo voy a decir eh, que busquen lo de la, la cuatro habitaciones um, just because it's a little bit cheaper and you have the opportunity to, you know, meet other students. You'll get to meet domestic students and other international students on campus. Um, again, pool, um, they have a lot of activities and it's literally right in front of the campus on Dale Mabry, which is next to the um, Buccaneer Stadium. So what do you need in order to apply to HCC? So primero, completando la aplicación en nuestro sitio web, eh, normalmente son 50 dólares, pero como están en Education USA, en la aplicación, pueden poner Education USA, and we'll go ahead and waive the fee. Necesita su high school transcript, um, English language proficiency. Um, these are a few, but if you go on our website, you'll see um, the others that we also accept. Um, the copy of your passport, and then proof of financial support, which is the 21,000. Um, Aquí están las fechas. So these are your dates and deadlines. Thank you, Lisa. Oh, here's my information. Just in case you want to contact me, you can reach me WhatsApp, my office phone, or via email. Thank you very much, Lisa, for no, all no. this uh, great information. Thank you very much. Let's give space right away. Thank you, Lisa. Goodbye. To uh, Olivia Liu from Pasadena City College, Community College. Hi, Olivia. The floor is yours. Gracias, Adri. Buenas tardes a todos. Desde la ciudad de Pasadena, California. ¿Pueden ver mi screen? ¿Lo pueden ver? ¿La presentación? Sí. Lo vemos perfecto. Te escuchamos gracias. muy bien. Muchas gracias. Uh, mucho gusto, uh, amigos de México, aquí desde Pasadena, California. Mi nombre es Olivia Liu. Uh, represento a uh, Pasadena City College y aquí tenemos un lema donde hablamos cómo rompemos barreras aquí. Y aquí en, las, en Pasadena City College nosotros nos encontramos en la ciudad de Pasadena que está súper, súper cerquita de Los Ángeles. Y, uh, uh, vamos a hablar un poquito más después de, este, de estos slides. Eh, ¿Cómo comenzar en un California Community College y por qué deben comenzar aquí en California un Community College? Uh, en California somos un sistema de, de, de educación que tenemos uh, uh, aquí en California, un sistema público y tenemos 115 eh, colegios, cole, eh, 
uh, community colleges eh, juntos eh, como un colectivo y uh, como un colectivo ofrecemos 2.5 millones de clases a estudiantes a través de, 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 del estado de California y muchos estudiantes no saben de que aquí en California el 50% de los estudiantes que comienzan en un community college en California se transfieren a la Universidad de California o al, a, a la Universidad Estatal de California. Así que así comenzando en, en una community college en California es, es, es un buen lugar para empezar. Y tenemos flexibilidad, flexibilidad de opciones para todos nuestros, todos nuestros estudiantes. Comenzando en base a City College, tienes tres opciones. Puedes comenzar y eh, obtener una, um, un título de asociado. Y um, una, seg una segunda opción es uh, bastantes estudiantes pueden empezar aquí y graduarse con un título de asociado y transferirse uh, o transfer a una universidad y terminar los dos años de un una licenciatura, un bachelor's degree. Muchos aquí cono lo conocemos como un modelo de 2 más 2, 2 plus 2. Y hay estudiantes que también tienen una tercera opción de no uh, obtener uh, un título de asociado y solamente transferir. Eh, comienzan dos años aquí en nuestro, nuestro community college y después, después se transfieren a terminar los, dos, los últimos dos años en una universidad. Aquí en Pasadilla City College, como, nos, como les, les uh, le introducí, Uh, nos encontramos en la, en la ciudad de Pasadena. Estamos a 16 kilómetros de Los Ángeles. Somos bien, bien cerquita. Um, ahora la temperatura aproximadamente 26 um, eh, degrees Celsius en centígrados. Y si quieren conocer un, un poquito más eh, una historia, uh, una ciudad histórica en Pasadena, um, nosotros somos 20 mil estudiantes eh, en Pasadena City College. Eh, como 500 estudiantes internacionales y representamos como 90 eh, uh, um, pa países a través de los, uh, del mundo. Y aquí en Pasadena City College, College todo es posible. Y lo que nos, uh, tres características que, únicas de nuestro college, hablamos un poco del Guided Pathways. Um, todos los estudiantes que llegan a Pasadena City College Um, tienen un plan semestre a semestre de lo que tienen, uh, lo que, tienen que hacer, y, uh, qué clases uh, pueden tomar o deben tomar para llegar a su meta. Um, eh, no importa si su meta sea de transferirse a una, a, a una universidad como UCLA o UC Berkeley o terminar su licenciatura, uh, su, su asociado aquí, su título de asociado. Y también tenemos un, eh, un, un, un soporte, un apoyo bien grande para nuestros estudiantes a través de nuestros counselors, nuestros consejeros, nuestros advisors, nuestros coaches que son para profesionales, eh, para profesionales y también nuestros peer leaders que son estudiantes eh, que, eh, que son como ustedes, ¿no? Y aquí en Pasadena City College hablamos mucho sobre transferir, sobre transfer support and success. Somos número uno en, la, en el estado de California de transfers a la Universidad de California más el Cali, a, la, a, la, a la Universidad Estatal de California. Um, en California son, somos un, eh, a Pasadena City College somos parte del, del, del sistema estatal, del sistema público. Así que tenemos bastante eh, acuerdos eh, con las universidades aquí públicas, pero también tenemos uh, transfer guarantees, garantías de transferencia que si estudiantes toman eh, ciertas clases, tienen un promedio um, específico, pueden transferirse um, uh, a, a universidades no solamente públicas, tam también privadas a través del estado de California y también tenemos 100 Um, cientos de articulaciones, eh, a, acuerdos de, 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 con otras universidades afuera del estado de California. Y otra, la tercera característica del Pasadena City College es, es um, el, el enfoque en tu preparación profesional. Uh, bastante de, nuestro, de nuestros estudiantes cuando entran no solamente toman, um, una, toman sus clases, también hay enfoque y ayuda a, a, a ayudar a estudiantes encontrarse, um, explorar carreras profesionales que pueden apoyarles en el futuro. Y lo más importante es, eh, bastante, bastantes estudiantes um, nos preguntan qué clase de programas tenemos aquí. Tenemos um, cientos de programas a través de seis um, comunidades profesionales en artes, comunicaciones y diseño. También tenemos eh, negocio e industria. 
Uh, también tenemos en Health Sciences, um, uh, también en Artes Liberales, um, Ciencias Sociales y también Ciencias, Tecnología, Ingeniería y Matemáticas. Nuestros programas más populares uh, usualmente en Ciencias, Tecnología, Ingeniería y Matemáticas, pero también tenemos eh, bastante, eh, bastante interés en programas de diseño y arte porque nosotros nos encontramos... Um, Uh, bien cerquita a Caltech, aquí nada más eh, menos de cinco minutos caminando hacia Caltech y también a varias universidades de arte aquí cerca. Uh, bastante de nosotros de eh, Community Colleges hablamos hoy de qué tan barato <ríe> eh, es el tuition, es la matrícula de venir aquí a estudiar. Eh, lo, no es nada diferente, uh, comenzando a pasar en City College, nuestro, uh, nuestra matrícula nada más es como 8 mil a 9 mil dólares. Um, si comienzas a una universidad como la Universidad de California o la, California, o, o la Universidad Estatal de California, usualmente los costos, costos son mucho, mucho más altos. Um, ¿Y cómo empezar aquí a pasar en City College? Es bien fácil, pueden ir a la página de web aquí. Y son seis pasos bien um, fáciles y toda nuestra aplicación es virtual. Y se necesita um, consultar o contactarnos. Aquí tienen, pueden scan el QR code aquí. Um, también tenemos eh, a, a, um, oportunidades para conocernos aquí virtual. Um, si quieren, uh, pueden notar mi, um, mi contacto aquí y, con, y hablar con y conectarse en el futuro con nosotros. Muchísimas gracias, Adri. Muchísimas gracias, Olivia. Thank you very much. Let's continue with our program. Uh, just a second. Let me check something. Yes. Uh, we are now going to have Seattle, Seattle College, Community College. And I think uh, we will have Johan Francois from Seattle Colleges. Yes, Johan. Hello. Hello. Hello everybody. Your floor is yours. Welcome. Thank you very much. And let me share my screen. All right, so uh, thank you very much for having me today. I am with Seattle Colleges, and I represent actually three uh, community colleges located in Seattle, uh, North Seattle College, Seattle Central College, and South Seattle College three public community colleges. Uh, all three colleges are located in the beautiful city of Seattle uh, on the north, uh, in the Northwest. And um, first I just wanted to uh, kind of go over the different locations. Each campus is a little bit unique in its location and its environment. So we have, we have something for everybody, uh, for everyone. So North is uh, in a very suburban neighborhood, uh, still very much connected to the city center with public transport um, and very close to the University of Washington, which is our number one transfer school. Seattle Central College is pretty much located in the city center, uh, walking distance from the uh, business hub and shopping district, five minutes from the Uni University of Washington, and walking distance from Seattle University, two great transfer options. Finally, uh, South Seattle College is located in a great residential neighborhood, uh, about eight miles south of downtown. Uh, it offers a, a very relaxed environment, a very safe uh, campus. So perfect for students who wanna be in a city, but yet have a, a, a vibe that's a little bit more relaxed. Uh, Seattle is a great place for international students. It's a very diverse city, uh, lots of great food, great culture, beautiful nature. We are kind of known for that. Um, and we're also very well known for some of our uh, multinational companies, uh, Boeing, Microsoft, Amazon, Nintendo, um, all, all have offices or are headquartered in Seattle. Uh, that creates a great environment for students, um, and yeah, Seattle is a fun place for students to live and study. Uh, we've got three different lakes uh, within the city limits, uh, plus the ocean, so uh, mountains are not too far, so in the winter students can go skiing. It's really a great place. So overall, we have about 45,000 students uh, between our three colleges, about 1,000 international students from 70 different countries. Uh, we are number one in tra international transfers to the University of Washington. 
Uh, and from Central and South America, we have uh, students from Mexico, Bolivia, Colombia, and Brazil, I would say the most. Uh, so I hope you'll be joining us in the future. Uh, things that are unique about Seattle Colleges, again, the locations uh, are quite unique. Uh, our students, of course, and uh, housing options. We do have on-campus apartments for our students, which makes for a very uh, enjoyable campus and city life. In terms of programs, of course, we have the two plus two transfer program. We call it university transfer. Um, we also have career training programs in about uh, 40 different fields. Um, most famous ones for international students, uh, the fashion design program, culinary arts, graphic design, nursing, web design, web development, and so on. The list goes on. Uh, Short-term certificates are perfect for students looking to do a gap year. So students who are interested in taking college level courses, but for a shorter period of time. Uh, finally, we do have our Institute of English. Uh, so students who may need uh, some ESL classes first uh, can start in the Institute of English, work their way up and uh, then enroll in a college program of their choice. Something very unique about Seattle Colleges and something that's only available in the state of Washington is our High School Completion Plus program. High School Completion Plus is like university transfer, it's a two plus two transfer program, but for students who have not yet finished high school in their home country. So students who are uh, still in grade 10 or grade 11, after finishing grade 10 or grade 11, if their GPA is sufficient, they can jump and go directly to, uh, to the college and enroll in year one of the bachelor's degree. They will study with us for two years. Um, they will at the end get an associate degree and a U.S. high school diploma at the same time. So it's a great way for students to start college early and save time and money. We do offer, uh, we have transfer pathways, of course, with many, many different universities. We transfer students all over the country to public and private universities, uh, high rank universities. Uh, and so to make the transfer process easier, we do offer transfer admission guarantees with about 20 of our partner universities. And so once you get admitted to Seattle Colleges, you can receive that guaranteed uh, transfer right from the beginning, right with your I-20. So it's a great way to kind of start thinking about where you might transfer. Our Institute of English has five levels. So again, for students who may need to enroll uh, in ESL classes first, uh, this is how it works. In level three, four, and five, this is what we call college bridge and students start taking college level courses uh, as part of the Institute of English. So it's a way for them to uh, kind of transition into the college studies a lot sooner um, and in a much better fashion. In terms of housing, of course, we do work with homestay agencies, so students can choose that option if that's what they prefer. Uh, being in the city, we do have off-campus apartments through for all three colleges. And like I mentioned earlier, we do have on-campus apartments. They are located on the Seattle Central Campus, but they serve students at all three colleges. Um, and so that provides a great option for students when they first arrive. Please follow us on social media. Um, our handle is the same for Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. It's Seattle Colleges INTL. Uh, please come to our website, intl.seattlecolleges.edu. Our admission process is quite simple, very similar to, uh, to the ones my colleagues you know, covered. We do have scholarships uh, and our tuition is only about $10,000 per year. Scholarships are between $1,000 and $5,000 per year. So you can get almost a 50% discount um, on your tuition cost. And the uh, minimum amount for the year is $23,000 uh, to get the I-20. So um, fairly reasonable for the US. And uh, we hope to see you in the future. If you have any questions, you can of course use the email addresses listed here. Again, my name is Johan, and I'll be happy to assist you with your study plans.
Thank you very much, John. And thank you everyone that keeps uh, connected. We are going to now welcome Snow College, uh, Ephraim Tripp. Hi, Ephraim. Welcome. The floor is yours. Thank you. Uh, let me just share my screen really quick. And then can you guys see my presentation? Yes, we can see it and we hear you very well. Perfect. Just want to make sure before I start plunging in. All right. So I'm from Snow College. We are a community college in uh, the state of Utah. Um, it's great to see such a variety of different places that you can go and all are great options. I hope you're all exploring and finding what's the best fit for you. So I'll present a little bit about what opportunities we have to offer at Snow College. Um, like I said, we're located in Utah with two different campuses, an academic and a technical college campus. Founded back in 1888, top, top 10 two-year college, uh, small class sizes, affordable tuition, all a lot of things that, are, uh, that my colleagues have talked about earlier. We also have international student-specific scholarships, and we are ranked as the safest location in the state of Utah to study. Uh, and Utah is a very safe place already, so it's, it's one of the safest places in the United States to be able to come and study. And in 2020, the Chronicle for Higher Education ranked Snow College as number one in the nation for student success among community colleges, which is a fantastic thing. And we really do pride ourselves in taking care of our students. Um, there are more than 70 different majors to choose from, including our English as a Second Language program. Um, we, during that program, you will not only uh, continue to improve your English skills, but also uh, begin your degree program for the for the second semester of ESL that you do. But we offer things like business, engineering, communication, commercial music, um, and two of these are actually bachelor's degrees. We do offer a bachelor's degree in music and software engineering, so you can choose whether to stay at Snow College for two years or all four years if you wish. Um, you, as you've seen plenty of times now, hopefully it's starting to really sink in how this all works with a community college. You get two years at Snow College, two years at any other university in the United States of your choice. The big benefits to that is affordability. You're saving tens of thousands of dollars per year by attending Snow College or another community college. High quality, uh, we, with, with small class sizes, it creates a personalized and high quality opportunity for you to engage with your professors and with your peers, to have larger opportunities for leadership, and to network more closely with, uh, with your professors and other professionals who come on campus, since you get a little more one-on-one -on -one time with them. So those are some huge benefits to coming to Snow College. Additionally, we are an open admission institution, which means that we do not require a minimum GPA or SAT. As soon as you apply, you are automatically accepted to Snow College, which simplifies uh, the process for you and takes some stress off of you as well uh, as you start to work your way into the educational system. This is maybe uh, an example of one of what one of our students has done as he has as he came to Snow College. He started at Snow College and transferred to one of our partner institutions, Northwest Missouri State University. After completing his bachelor's degree there, he is now transferred to Dartmouth and is continuing to study neuroscience. So in reality, you can start at Snow College and then move on to any university that you would like to. We have great connections all over the country from New York to California to Seattle, well not to Seattle, sorry, not to Seattle, to Oregon, to Washington, Texas, wherever you would like to go. Um, we, we have some great connections there, and if you have a specific university you'd like to pursue, then we are ready to help you to reach that goal. We also offer specific scholarships for our international students, uh, and we, about 98, 99% of all of our international students have a $5,000 per year scholarship, which is renewable for the duration of their studies. And it's a very simple scholarship application, just a short essay explaining your academic excellence, volunteer and extracurricular activities, and leadership activities. And because of our current administration, we are able to guarantee that $5,000 per year to all international students who apply for this scholarship. So if you want a guaranteed scholarship, then Snow College has one to offer to all international students. And in addition to this scholarship, there are other scholarships you can pursue, such as merit, academic, leadership, athletic, 
whatever else you might be interested in, but this comes from our office specifically to give you that extra boost of support. So with that scholarship, I, I have both the tuition without and with the scholarship, but I'm hoping that you will take the opportunity and apply for it if you do choose to come to Snow College. With the scholarship, tuition is about $9,000 per year, living expenses about $4,400, and health insurance about $1,100, bringing your annual total to about $14,500 per year. Um, and we accept that on a bank statement. If you would like to come to Snow College, you can. You will need a bank statement showing at least $14,500 upon receipt of the scholarship. Um, so that way we are able to uh, give you your I-20, your admission documents to help you get your visa. But again, that scholarship is guaranteed given that you apply for it. We also have a big benefit at Snow College. We have on-campus housing available for our students. And what this allows for you, the big, big benefit of on-campus housing is that we have payment plans. Uh, and in that payment plan, you can pay for tuition, housing, uh, meal plans and other fees and, and, and other uh, financial pieces that come with Snow College all in one place over the course of a few months or up, up to five months at a time. So when you do on-campus housing, you can put all of that in one place, pay for it all in one place, and split up the payments a little at a time. With off-campus housing, uh, you, you can't do that. You wouldn't be able to bundle it as much into that payment plan option but both on-campus and off-campus housing options that we have are within walking distance of the, the university. So you wouldn't have to buy a car, you can walk everywhere that you need to go. It's, it's a small, tight-knit ca campus with about 5,000 students. Um, so that option of on-campus housing really provides a great opportunity for you to take advantage of our payment plans and also being really close to campus and having everything connected just in one place for your finances. Just some fun pictures of Snow College. We have all four seasons um, with beautiful spring, summer, and fall. And we love to take advantage of the outdoors and other amenities that we have around the state of Utah, taking our students skiing and snowboarding to national parks and other wonderful places. Our admission process is very simple. With uh, You can apply online using this QR code or just go to our website. We don't require an English proficiency score, but we do recommend it if you would like uh, to be able to just jump right into academic courses. We require some ba basic documents. And if you apply, uh, please put down in your agent uh, platform or in the agent field, Education USA Mexico, and we will waive the application fee that we have listed here. So make sure you, you do that if you decide to apply for Snow College. If you have any questions for me, feel free to reach out and I would love to hear from you. Thanks Thank so you much. very much. Thank you, Efra. Uh, we are going to now welcome uh, Cody McBee. I hope I'm pronouncing correctly your last name. Uh, Cody, uh, join us from College of the Desert. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you so much. Yes, this I'm Cody McCabe. I will try to share my screen now. And could I just confirm that you can see it okay? Yes, we can see it. Okay, great. So yes, thank you very much for welcoming me. Um, I'm happy to give you a brief introduction on College of the Desert and to share a welcome video in Spanish from one of our international students from Mexico. Uh, so my colleagues here, my community college colleagues and friends have given you a great and thorough introduction to community colleges. I'm very appreciative of that. So I'll kind of keep what I speak about specifically focused on College of the Desert or COD. So uh, as you can see here, very beautiful campus. In fact, we were ranked one of the 50 most beautiful college campuses in the U.S. It's a very inspiring, comfortable, great place to study. We're a small to medium sized community college with approximately 10,000 students. And we enroll around 130 international students each year from over 25 countries. So COD has won many state and national awards for the levels of success that our students achieve in our programs. And we also have great funding for student success and resources. And like many of my other colleagues here, we have great partnerships with transfer universities in California and around the United States. And of course, the most popular ones for our students include campuses in the University of California system, California State University system, and many private universities like the University of Southern California. So our location, it's actually pretty awesome. 
So we're right in the heart of Southern California, about two hours from uh, Los Angeles by car, two hours from San Diego by car, two hours from the Arizona border by car, two hours from Mexico by car. Uh, we also have an uh, international airport about 20 minutes from the college with direct flights all over North America. And so at College of the Desert, you're actually really lucky because you get to study and live in one of America's most popular and loved tourist destinations. So we're in the greater Palm Springs area of the Coachella Valley. And so we get about 16 million visitors a year that come to COD's local area uh, for our beautiful resorts, our professional sports, our stunning natural environment, and of course, our famous music and film festivals uh, each year. So perhaps you have heard of the Coachella Music Festival. Uh, it takes place only about 20 minutes from campus, so it's very popular with COD students. So it just kind of goes to show the type of uh, lifestyle and uh, environment that you live in if you become a COD student. And so as a student, right, we're really going to focus on what you want to study. And it's a very, very flexible environment in that regard. You can come for one semester, you can as a gap semester, or a visiting student for uh, one year, one semester, you can get a certificate in one year, you can get an associate degree in two years. There's over 100 different academic programs to choose from. But some of the more popular ones with our international students would, of course, be business, computer science, natural sciences. Actually, di digital design is becoming a lot more popular as well, too. And some of the unique programs at COD are hospitality management and architecture, which are important parts of our local economy. So like many of my other colleagues here, uh, we do have an intensive English academy for English language learners. It's a three level program and uh, you don't need any English proficiency to start. And when you finish level three, you can begin an academic program at College of the Desert without taking TOEFL, IELTS or any other type of English proficiency test. And so some other advantages that COD offers uh, international students includes a dedicated international counselor who helps you choose all of your classes before most other students each term and helps you find the best fit program to achieve your academic goals, your transfer goals, or whatever it is you are here to study with us for. And many of our professors are also professional, professionals in their industry. So they teach you how to be successful in your career and help you find internships and work experience before and after you graduate. And so to become a student here, just like with my uh, colleagues from other community colleges, it's a pretty simple process, very flexible too. So uh, English proficiency is the main thing that we're looking for in terms of your admissibility. And that would be for College of the Desert, 40 or higher on the TOEFL, 4.5 on the IELTS, or 75 on Duolingo. And there's many other ways that you can satisfy that. Uh, then no SAT, no ACT, no application essays, no uh, minimum high school graduate uh, scores, uh, GPAs. And um, there is no fixed application deadline. And again, if you're participating in this event, we just need to know that you're applying after an Education USA Mexico presentation, and there will be no reason to pay the application fee. And so speaking of not paying the application fee, uh, College of the Desert is really one of the best value colleges in California. So your total expenses, everything from tuition, books, meals, uh, housing, insurance, all of that is going to be less than $21,000 per year. That's the I-20 cost that many people will tell you about. You're also eligible for several different types of scholarships at College of the Desert. We have a very generous and wealthy foundation, so that includes scholarships specifically for international students and then many of the other scholarships that are available to all students at College of the Desert. And so student life at COD, I think many of our international students would say that COD's exciting, welcoming and friendly student life is probably one of the best things about being a student here. They're often very surprised at how quickly they make local friends, how connected they get, the types of clubs and student activities they can be involved, involved in on and off campus. But I think maybe the best thing I could do to introduce you to our student life is let you hear it from our student from Mexico, Andres Prieto. He just recorded this for you yesterday. Hola amigos, ¿cómo estamos? Estamos aquí desde COD en el hermoso... Coachella Valley. Eh, mi nombre es Andrés Prieto. Yo estoy estudiando la carrera de Computer Science. Yo soy originalmente de la Ciudad de México, de México, evidentemente. Vengo a platicarles un poco de por qué pienso que COD es una gran opción para cualquier estudiante internacional, para cualquier carrera que esté buscando, para cualquier tipo de planes que tenga para su futuro eh, y eso empieza desde el estando en clases 
aquí que siempre tanto los miembros de la facultad como del staff y tus propios compañeros siempre están buscando lo mejor para ti, siempre están tratando de apoyarte dentro de tus clases, así como también todas las cosas que hacemos que no se limitan al salón de clases, sino que también hacemos en el campus en todos los eventos, ya sea deportivos, eh, viendo los partidos de nuestros estudiantes atletas o participando en alguno de los eh, cientos de clubes que tenemos aquí dentro del campus. También eh, contamos con opciones fuera del campus para ir con tus amigos y divertirte un poco, como el Coachella Fest, que es mundialmente conocido, o también tenemos Indian Wells, que es el quinto torneo más importante en el mundo del tenis. Eh, también, como ya mencioné, eh, siempre los miembros del staff, de la facultad, tus compañeros siempre están ahí para ti, siempre te van a mostrar una buena cara, siempre van a estar apoyándote. Eh, todos en Coachella Valley siempre son muy amigables y aquí siempre vamos a estar tratando de apoyarte, como lo han sido los miembros de la uh, Oficina de Estudios Internacionales para mí, para lo que tengo planeado para mi futuro, para transferirme a otra escuela. Y por eso siento que COD es una gran opción para cualquier estudiante internacional y creo que estas son razones más que suficientes. Hola amigos, ¿cómo están? All right, so I'm glad you got a chance to hear a little bit from Andres, great student, plays on our football team, helps out with social media, has a lot of great local friends, so he'd love to tell you a lot more about his experiences here at College of the Desert. Just one last shot of our beautiful campus where you see in the winter we've got snow on the mountains above us, but beautiful warm weather, 350 days of sunshine every year, so it's a really comfortable, great place to be. So if you'd like to learn more about College of the Desert from me or from Andres, who you just saw, we'd be happy to talk with you uh, however you want. This is our website here. You can contact us by email there and uh, follow us. Andres would appreciate that, cod underscore ie on Instagram. And I'll drop this into the chat as well so you have easy access to it. So I appreciate this opportunity to introduce you to College of the Desert. Thank you. Thank you very much, Cody. Thank you for being here. And we are now going to welcome Erika Cuevas. Hi, Erika. She joined us from Fox Valley Technical College. The floor is yours. Hi, everyone. Thanks so much. Um, I'm going to get started here. I'm going to share with you a um, quick video. Um, and to give you a little bit more information just about Fox Valley Technical College. And hopefully you can all see my screen. Yes, we can see it. Perfect. Fox Valley Tech is affordable education. Fox Valley Tech is hands-on training. Fox Valley Tech has small class size. Fox Valley Tech is a home away from home. Business and management programs cover a broad spectrum of career options. You can choose from programs in human resources, management development, legal studies, meeting and event management, supply chain management, and more. Health Science. Get the hands-on training and experience you need to be successful in a healthcare career. At FBTC, we have programs that will prepare you to become a dental hygienist, nurse, occupational therapist, medical assistant, or health information technician. IT. Great careers are available in the information technology field. At FBTC, we have seven associate degree programs in networking, cybersecurity, system administration, computer support, software development, data analytics, and web development and design. Manufacturers are using machine automation and controls to produce quality products faster, more reliable, and with greater efficiency. Students will learn to install, troubleshoot, and repair automation systems for business and industry. Students will gain knowledge and skills related to electronics, computers, control system, programming, robots, fluid power, sensors, and more. When you're not in class, you can have lots of fun in student life. And I can say that because I volunteer there. You can live just a few minutes away from campus at Tech Village, where you will meet fellow students from the United States and across the world. Fox Valley Tech will make you succeed. They have a full-time staff that will be there for you and answer any of your questions. 
Their number one goal is to make you comfortable and feel welcomed at FVTC. Appleton is located just south of Green Bay and is near major cities like Milwaukee, Chicago and Minneapolis. Appleton is located on the beautiful Fox River. Downtown Appleton offers fine dining, local shops and the performing arts center. So hopefully that gave you guys a little bit of information about Fox Valley Tech. And I'm just going to switch over um, quickly to a short um, just presentation to give you a little bit more um, specific information about who we are and um, what we do. Um, so I'm gonna reshare my screen here. Well, you can see the screen as well. So um, Fox Valley Tech was established um, in 1912. So we are um, in terms of uh, two-year colleges and community colleges and older institution, we enroll approximately 50,000 students a year. Um, as a lot of the other institutions, we do also offer an intensive English language program and have over 65 associates of applied science degrees. Um, us. Um, so what are our classes like? So our average class sizes are about uh, 12 to 1 ratio. Um, we really do focus on uh, personalized attention from your instructors and all of our programs and courses focus on hands-on and practical experiences. And this means that internships are part of every single one of our programs because we do really believe that that direct uh, experience is what makes a huge difference in resume building, but also in really understanding the work and the information that you're learning in your classrooms. Um, so some other things that we offer at Fox Valley Tech, um, we have a lot of different types of counseling services, diversity and inclusion services, employment connections to help you find those internships and OPT options that have been talked about earlier. Um, we also offer a lot of leadership programs. We have a campus cl care clinic available to students, um, which is our health center. Also, um, Fox Valley Tech students all receive free public transportation in the Fox Cities community, as well as uh, free access to fitness center and free access to our local YMCA, which is another fitness center um, that we have. So what should you expect with your application and admissions process? So we try to make everything as simple as possible. We wanna uh, avoid any barriers that you may uh, have as part of your process. So really the application takes only about 10 minutes to complete. Everything can be submitted online. And our processing time is anywhere from three to five business days once we've received all of your information. Um, and then at the time of application, really what we're gonna ask for are your high school transcripts and a passport copy. And then after admissions, we're gonna be looking for a certification of funding and those bank statements. For Fox Valley Tech, you'd be looking at about $19,100 for that bank statement. Um, which includes um, your housing, uh, tuition, and all your um, personal expenses for the year. Um, and so that is, let me just, um, I'm going to stop sharing here. Um, And I will put my information in uh, the chat, but that's all I have for you tonight. Thanks so much um, for being such an attentive audience. Thank you. Thank you very much for joining us today, Erica. Um, we are going to continue with Faith. 
Faith Dobbs from Gold, uh, Gadsden State Community. I don't know, Faith, if you can hear me. I can hear you. Thank you. Welcome. The floor is yours. Okay. Let me stop my video. Okay. And I will share my screen. Uh, let's see here. Can you see my screen? Yes, we see it. Okay. Uh, let me see, start from the beginning here. Okay. Welcome to Gadsden State. Uh, we are in, uh, let me just introduce you to our newest building, the Science Building. Um, we are located in Alabama and uh, we are right here Northeast of Alabama. And uh, Gadsden State's mission is to prepare students from all backgrounds to have a quality education and have a successful, um, be successful in their uh, academic goals and have uh, uh, hopefully find a job in the future. Uh, we have 70 plus programs and we have academic programs you know, the usual business, uh, sciences to social sciences. And then we do have health science programs such as dental assisting, uh, sonography, as well as a two-year uh, RN program and radiology technology. And we also offer technical programs from air conditioning and refrigeration to civil engineering, uh, and to mechanical design and mechatronics, robotics and robotics and automation. Since in Alabama, we do host a lot of manufacturing companies such as Hyundai, uh, Mercedes-Benz, uh, Honda, et cetera. Um, as our, my colleagues have mentioned before, there is a two plus two option in the United States where you take two years in college and then uh, transfer to university and get your uh, four-year degree. It is, uh, this way you do have a higher rate of success in achieving a bachelor's degree. And that's, uh, there's been a study on that. Um, as you can see here, you can do your first and second year at Gadsden State, third and fourth year at a university and transfer to university and get your four-year degree. And uh, a lot of our students have done that. Uh, that is a lot, is the path that they have taken. Um, okay, at Gadsden State, there's no application fee. And uh, here's our tuition. Uh, it's fairly reasonable, affordable and uh, 7,000 for fall semester that includes your room and board. Uh, our our um, college has a, a residence hall and a uh, cafeteria. And we do have a payment plan. So um, it will make it, e this makes it easier for students to pay for, for their fees. And our, our residence hall is, uh, is called Fowler Residence Hall. It's 110 bed capacity. We have all these amenities and our cafeteria is open Monday to Friday um, with three meals a day. On weekends, our, there's transportation to the local shopping areas twice a, twice a day. So uh, students have the option of being able to go out of the campus. Our international programs started since 1968 and over 140 countries have attended since that year. And our Language Institute, the Alabama Language Institute started in 1973. It's the first language institute in Alabama, only intensive English program at a community college and uh, recognized as the oldest in the Southeast by NAFSA. The Alabama Language Institute's mission statement is to prepare students for academic success, 
help students obtain their TOEFL score, improve English for professionals in the workplace, encourage students to respect cultures different from their own, and play a role in promoting peace and understanding of the world. Um, this is our Language Institute Intensive English Program. It's a pathway to college. You can get into college by uh, completing the, the highest levels of the in Intensive English Program at, with A's and B's, or you can also enter college with um, a 500 or higher from the Gadsden States Internet institutional TOEFL, which is offered every semester. All right, here's our, uh, our alumni roster from a deputy foreign minister for, Jap for the Japanese government, uh, Toshiko Abe, Ahmed Ilbabri with Schnamberger Engineer, it's a German company, Dr. Echevere, surgeon, and he's still here on, in our area and, and so on. We have registered nursing students that have uh, received jobs here in our area. In addition to English classes, ALR program also includes student advising, conversation partners and practice TOEFL ex exam. Our community is very connected to our college and so we have plenty of activities for students, uh, organizations outside uh, the college invites us for dinners, games, and field trips. Uh, we do offer a field trip to Washington, D.C., and this is one of our last ones that we've done. And uh, it's been a successful trip to introduce international students to our country's capital. And we do offer a, a trip to Disney World. It's a Disney leadership workshop and it's a fun way to be trained in leadership as well as enjoy the fun rides at Disney World. International tea is one of the things that we, events that we offer during International Education Week. So students can can share their culture and language to the community. We usually get about uh, 300 people for this event. Another event is our international, uh, international festival, another uh, event to share their culture and their language. Students Without Borders is a club on ca campus and it's a fun way for students to get to know other international students from all over the world, as well as Americans in our area. Advantages to our program, to summarize it, it is a low cost program. We accept application year round on campus residence hall, easy transition from ALI to college, small class size, individual attention, established community connection and longevity and experience. Thank you very Based much, our staff. Oh, excellent. And you're welcome here. We would like to see you at Gadsden State. Here's my link. And that's it. And I will share my uh, information to everybody. Thank you. Thank you very much, Faith, for joining us and for sharing. And right now we are going to welcome Claudia Ortiz. She's joining us from Mass Bay Community College. Thank you, Claudia. The floor is yours. Thank you. Um, yes, so I'm just gonna share my screen. Um, Perfect. I don't know, so Faith, if you can stop your sharing. We'll yes. appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. Uh, we are still looking at your screen. Maybe you can come back to uh, Zoom and go share screen, stop sharing screen. Maybe I'll, I'll try. Do you see mine? 
Yes. Perfecto. Thank you, Claudia. Ok, buenas, buenas noches para todos. Mi nombre es Claudia Ortiz y estoy, es un gusto estar con todos ustedes. Eh, sé que muchos de mis colegas ya han dado mucha información, lo que es un community college, entonces los dejaré con un video eh, de una estudiante de México. Um, entonces, eh, permítanme acá un momentito. Sí. ¿Pueden escucharlo? Ahorita todavía no vemos ni escuchamos el video. ¿Todavía no lo pueden ver? Estoy viendo una presentación, dice Student Story, pero no hay nada moviéndose ni escuchamos mm, nada. Bueno, entonces seguiremos para la otra página. Tal vez podemos regresar de nuevo porque sabemos del tiempo. Bueno, eh, Mass Bay está localizado en Massachusetts. Creo que todos mis colegas han estado en la parte del West Coast. Eh, Mass Bay se encuentra en el East Coast. Eh, es muy conocida por todos los colleges y universidades que están acá en Massachusetts. Eh, se ha considerado como número uno de Community College acá por los éxitos y las localidades de trabajo que nuestros estudiantes han tenido. Ofrecemos más de 70 programas eh, en diferentes academias, eh, como lo es de negocios, eh, ciencias de las ciencias de matemáticas, negocios, eh, también de los estudios de salud, educación. Estamos localizados a 300 kilómetros de Nueva York, y algunos minutos de la ciudad de Boston. Tenemos tres sedes, una que es en Wesley, Framingham y Ashland. Tenemos transporte público para todos los estudiantes. También ahora se les ofrece un servicio de Uber eh, para que los estudiantes puedan tener acceso de diferentes sedes y del eh, tren. Acá le llamamos el T. Eh, tenemos diferentes líneas de tren donde los estudiantes pueden transportarse. Hoy en día, Boston se conoce como una de las ciudades de College Town, donde muchos de los estudiantes vienen a estudiar. Eh, es muy conocido ya que tenemos las cuatro estaciones, el invierno, el verano, el otoño y la primavera. Mass Bay eh, ofrece todos estos Certificados, que es un año, y los eh, asociados, que son dos años. Son muy populares entre eh, los estudiantes internacionales. La mayoría de estudiantes vienen a estudiar los negocios o salud, lo que es enfermería y también en ciencias. Todo lo que se deba al tema de tecnología. Y... Por, eh, tenemos unos programas, por ejemplo, los de ingeniería. Eh, los estudiantes también desean estudiar en negocios eh, internacionales o en el programa de eh, biotechnology. La verdad que son muy populares con todos nuestros estudiantes y por las ventajas de que tenemos eh, de acuerdos con diferentes universidades lo cual es eh, públicas y privadas. Pronto les estaré platicando de los éxitos de los estudiantes. Ofrecemos el servicio de un académico de advisor para que puedan darle el seguimiento de todos los créditos que están tomando con nosotros en Mass Bay. Todos los créditos que estarán tomando son garantizados para una transferencia a las universidades estatales y universidades privadas. Hemos podido ver el éxito de los estudiantes que se han transferido a la Universidad de Harvard. Eso fue hace dos años a la, a la Universidad de MIT estudiantes que están estudiando todo lo que es ingeniería. A nuestros estudiantes también se transfieren a lo que es UMass University, que es muy bien conocida, tiene un programa muy complejo y también les ofrecen algún tipo de becas. 
Eh, estamos también teniendo muchas de las universidades y los convenios con a hoy mismo la Universidad de, de Boston o Northeastern o ya sea Bentley, Babson, todos los estudiantes que están estudiando mercadeo o negocios eh, ofrecen un tipo de becas para los estudiantes y de esa forma ellos están interesados de venir a estudiar a Mass Bay porque han escuchado el testimonio y de nosotros estudiantes que se han graduado y estas transferencias han sido eh, exitosos para todos nuestros estudiantes. Eh, ¿Cuál es el costo? La aplicación es gratis, está en línea, eh, no hay ningún costo para, eh, de pago al principio. Eh, después de que ustedes sean aceptados, tienen el, la oportunidad de participar en orientación y registrarse a las materias. Hoy en día, el costo para la vivienda, incluyendo la, la matrícula, serían 13 mil dólares, ya que es el costo de vivienda aquí en Massachusetts. Pero también te ofrecemos un plan de pago para los estudiantes que estén interesados. Eh, también se requiere que ellos tengan un tipo de salud médico. Eso es eh, en, prácticamente es más de lo que es la colegiatura. Pero si los estudiantes tienen un programa de salud eh, internacional, pueden desear de no pagar el, el salud médico de Mass Bay. Así que la colegiatura de eso iría bajando. Los estudiantes requieren, aparte de la aplicación, como todos nuestros colegas lo han uh, mencionado, eh, inglés como proficiencia del TOEFL, el 62. Eh, hoy en día ofrecemos un examen eh, en línea y es absolutamente gratis, donde no tienen que preocuparse de tomar o pagar el TOEFL o Duolingo o los EITL. Eh, prácticamente pueden tomar el examen con nosotros gratis uh, después de que llenen la aplicación. Y para recibir el documento de la I-20, tienen que entregar los documentos para la visa, que son 26 mil dólares para un estimado de la vivienda que es aquí en Massachusetts, incluyendo la colegiatura. Ofrecemos muchos tipos de apoyo para los estudiantes, donde ellos pueden uh, adquirir todo el apoyo, incluyendo la tutoría que es 24 horas en línea, eh, si no desean venir al campo o están terminando una tarea por el fin de semana y tienen acceso a este tipo de tutoría. Igualmente, eh, pueden hacer tu, cualquier tipo de taller para una especialidad de una de las clases que ellos puedan eh, estar interesados en avanzar para el siguiente semestre. También ten, eh, tenemos y ofrecemos el, los centros para lectura y escritura donde son especialistas y están ayudando a todos nuestros estudiantes. Ofrecemos el tipo de becas para los estudiantes basado en los intereses académicos. Eh, ya cuando sean estudiantes, ellos pueden solicitar a este tipo de becas y basados a las circunstancias también. Entonces, constamos de, de una fundación y de unos donadores que gracias a ellos podemos ofrecer este tipo de becas. Eh, hoy en día podemos ofrecer vivienda a través de una universidad que está a 20 minutos de Mass Bay y los estudiantes pueden vivir en esta universidad que es Framingham State eh, University, donde muchos de nuestros estudiantes cuando terminan Mass Bay continúan el bachelor y pueden tener acceso a todas las actividades o eventos en esta vivienda mientras están siendo estudiantes en Mass Bay. Eh, acá les dejo eh, la información de Mass Bay y la página donde pueden tener acceso como solicitar. 
Y Perfecto. nos pueden uh, contactar en los medios de comunicación. Gracias. No sé si, Clau, nos pudieras compartir esos datos aquí en el chat para que también se queden grabados. Claro. Muy bien. So, the only thing I, I want to say is thank you very much for joining. This has been a super important, super efficient uh, event. Thank you everyone um, that could join today and stay up until right now. Thank you and see you next time.